Greetings. In this screencast, I will demonstrate how to construct an inner arc of a circle using GeoGebra. The first step is to construct a circle. Here's my circle. A is the center, B is a point on the circumference. I want to hide the point B and construct two new points, C and D, on the circle. And I want to draw line segments from A to C and from A to D. Now, we actually see two arcs here, a minor arc from C to D, and then a major arc going the long way around from D to C. We want to display one of these two arcs depending on the measure of the central angle at A. So let's create this central angle, click on the Angle tool, then C, A, D. Here's my angle alpha. Notice that alpha can be less than 180 degrees, or if we move points, it can be within 180 degrees. All right, let's hide the circle C for now. I want to construct an arc, and we construct it using an if statement. If the measure of the angle alpha is less than or equal to 180 degrees, then I want to display the arc of the circle little c going from big C to big D. Notice that the arc is in counterclockwise order. Now, if alpha is greater than 180 degrees, I want to display the arc of the circle little c going from D to C. There's our arc. And notice that we always have a minor arc. So if this angle is greater than 180 degrees, the arc flips. Let's change the properties on this arc. Let's make thickness 7 so it really stands out and a color of red. And let's bring the circle back. And now we see that we've constructed a minor arc. The arc flips when this angle exceeds 180 degrees. That's it. Thank you very much for watching. I hope this is helpful. Have a great day.